Hi everyone, today we're in Waltham, Massachusetts at the former site of the Walter E. Fernald School, which was founded in 1888 as a school for the training and teaching of children with severe disabilities. That's a little bit questionable though, there are stories of it more being uh, sort of a place for foundlings or children who were orphans or didn't have anywhere to go. One sad story was told by a man who had been dropped off in the lobby as an eight-year-old boy. His father said, you wait here, I'm gonna get the car, and then never returned, leaving him to this school. In 1925, it was named for Walter Fernald, who was a doctor who was an avid fan of eugenics. And from that point on, it became a place where there were many experiments of the medical sort done on the children that were living at this school. And of course, they were subjected to abuses of all kinds. In the 1960s, they had something known as the Science Club. And the children that joined the Science Club would get little extra niceties little extra meal, a little bit of a trip off site, but what they were actually being subjected to was a radiation test that was co-founded between MIT and Quaker Oats, where they would be given radioactive oatmeal to see how it turned out. This became the undoing of the school because they were basically sued when people found out what was actually happening, and the school closed not until 2014 did it close completely. But this site is known to be haunted by violent ghosts, malicious, dangerous ghosts, um, who are very angry, as you can imagine, under the circumstances. There's a graveyard nearby with about 236 graves of people who died at both this location and the Metropolitan State Hospital as well. So I don't really want to linger here that long today. That's the end of our ghastly dispatch. We'll see you tomorrow.